One of the ugliest names and posters of a movie I've seen this year, The Kane Mutiny Court Martial, which turned out to be the last movie from director William Friedkin, who directed the original Exorcist. So that was a surprise, because honestly, this looked so boring, and when I heard it was releasing on Paramount Plus, that didn't help, and then the first scene and title card show up, and it just does not look good. Like it was filmed on a camera fresh off of Survivor, like an extended episode of JAG. But then the movie starts, and it reels you in, and then you lean forward, eager to learn more, and then you're so engaged in the dialogue, you're on the edge of your seat. Normally, I love single location, movies, but in this case, a court-martial hardly seems like an exciting locale. Even A Few Good Men has several scenes outside the courtroom, but by the end of it, you don't even notice. The dialogue and acting is so good, you're fully committed. And it's a murky ending with an interesting twist if you haven't seen the original play. I really enjoyed it. And Kiefer Sutherland is no Humphrey Bogart, who was in a previous movie of this, but it was good. So four out of five stars for me, and follow my Letterboxd account, linked in my bio for more.